Here's a quick guide on how to change the stroke pressure of a line on Affinity Designer for the iPad. If you wanted to draw a line with a taper, you could easily pick up a brush that has a taper on it and use the pressure of the pen to control that taper. But if you've got a uniform stroke line like we've got on this wing logo and we want to change that pressure after we've drawn it, we can come over to the stroke palette and come down to this graph and there's a pressure section and we can go in and change the thickness of that stroke by altering these lines and that just gives a much more natural hand-drawn look so the most simple operation there is to pick up the end of the line and drop it so we've got a fat line that runs into a fine line but there's no limit really to what you can do you can tap on the line to add a new pressure point and you can put in as many as you want depending on what kind of effect you're looking for as well as adding in new nodes if you tap on a node that you don't need anymore or not happy with if you don't want to move it you want to delete it you can just tap on that and you can delete the node and if you've got a lot of nodes you can just tap on one of them and go to reset pressure to flatten the line again. But what I want to do for this one is to put a nice taper onto the inside edge of all these lines to give a nice hand-drawn logo look. So let's just do that now. If you found this video useful, give me a like and please do check out my other videos and my channel homepage. If you've got any questions, leave a comment.